Hey guys, it's Michelle and welcome to a day in the life of me. Today's video, you're not even going to see my face. I'm just going to go through and show you all the different palettes that I have. Um, I've got them all fit into this one box. Um, and here we go. Okay, so I'm going to try to hold this steady. <laughs> I have all of my singles or, you know, just like, well, I mean, that one's a palette, but, you know, that was from the Dollar Tree, so it was literally a dollar. Um, and then the rest of them are either I got from Subscription Box, um, or, like, this is my blush that I use more so as, you know, like this, my, just my regular pressed powder. So I've got those two. Um, and this, oops is CoverGirl Classic Color um, in Natural Glow for the powder. Um, let me grab whatever fell. Okay, we're back. Um, not that it even mattered to you guys. <laughs> but I have, um, I think this, yeah, this is from the, the Balm Alternative Rock. And it's, you can't tell on camera, but that is like a purple color. It doesn't really show up all that well. But there it is. It's like a purple shimmer. Um, yeah, I'm not going to swatch any of these, but that's a purple shimmery color. And then, of course, Wonder Beauty. Um, I got these two from Ipsy as well. I should have another one somewhere, actually. Yeah, there should be a third. It's probably still in the box. But this is an eyeshadow. And this is in Blossom. Yep, that's on the floor. It's going to stay on the floor for now. And then this is a highlighter in After Hours. And I actually have one of these in my um, giveaway pile as well. And then here's a bronzer by Hula, uh, or Benefits Cosmetics. I believe this came in an Ipsy, or a uh, Sephora Play, probably. And it's a really dark bronzer contour. And let me grab this. It's a loose pigment. I have no idea what to do with it. Um, it's Naked Cosmetics. It's a, let's see, do you all see a shade? Painted Canyon, I guess, is the shade. I've been, I opened it just because I thought maybe I was seeing things. Never actually used it. Um, this, if you watched my first Ipsy bag in March, you know that I got the Lottie London. And this is also a highlight. And then I have Moods. Uh, this is a bright blue. And you can see Estate and Kaleido Cosmetics and then the Orza. All three of those um, came in my Ipsy bag. Um, I think everyone got the same. Sorry about the shaking, guys. Everyone got the same color um, blush. Hopefully you can't hear, but it's really, the wind is really picking up outside right now. Um, and then I got the highlight in Dew, or, no, it's in Lit, excuse me. This is not, oh, you see the cat tree over there. This is not easy to do one-handed. And then Orza. Oh, it looks like we're getting rain. And there is that claw. And then just a few more little things. Um... This is, was the first highlighter I ever owned. Um, I literally just bought it recently, probably mid-March. Um, it's Hello Halo. It's Wet n Wild. And it's a blush lighter and um, I, it's a blush and a highlighter duo, I guess, um, in the color. Yeah, if you guys can see the color, perfect for you guys. I, I don't see the color. <laughs> so there's that. This came um, from a bag that I purchased off Macari. Um, it's just a like purple highlighter, I guess. This and this I purchased from the Dollar Tree. This pink is a very good pink and it goes on with any type of brush. These colors will only work with um, the sponge applicators. So I bought some more at Dollar Tree last time I was there. So there's those. And then this is the oldest palette that I own. 
um, by Tartiste. Yeah, Tartiste Protego. Um, I may end up destashing this because it is really old, and you know, I actually may do another, may do just one eye look with it just before I decide to toss it. But there's those, and then one moment, and I will get more out. All right, guys, we're back. And I found that other Wander Beauty that I said I knew I had. Um, this one is more of a bronzer, I think. Um, it's Trip to Costa Rica. Um, this is what it looks like on the outside. And then here is the inside. I mean, I guess it's just a darker highlight, maybe. I don't know. Um, but it's fairly dark on the skin. So there's that. And then I do have another older palette. Um, it's the Tetris by Ipsy. And I've done a review on this once before. And the reason that I have not tossed it is because I don't have anything that is as shocking of a blue as what um, is in the top out. So I have not gotten rid of it for, because of that. And, you know, the fact that I have a hard time getting rid of things. <laughs> okay, so next, I'm going to go in a specific order, believe it or not. First, I'm going to go with the items that I have purchased with my own money. And then go into the items that I have either been gifted or won. So first, we have this duo. Um, it came for free in a Ulta bag like you purchase so much and you get some free stuff and this is one of the free items um here's an eyeshadow palette um called bloom and there are those colors they don't they take a long time to build up i that's not something i would have purchased with my own money and then these are supposed to be it's supposed to be a blush um i don't use them as blush i actually use them as eyeshadow because they don't perform very well and you'll hear either a baby or a kid crying outside. Um, and then here is the uh, Makeup Revolution London uh, Mermaids Forever. I'm not going to take it out of the box, um, but those are the colors. And I've done an eye look with this already. So let me take care of those and I will be back to the next. Okay, we're back. So here, um, I received this from Ipsy um, this month. Oh, I'm not going to open it. I didn't realize the colors were on the back. Um, and I've done an eye look with it. I want to mess with it some more just to get better with my technique. Um, but there's that one. This one, I received my very first BoxyCharm. Um, you are allowed to select like a free gift um, for your first month. And I chose this palette. Um, Ace Beauté uh, Scarlet Dusk. Let me try to open it without ripping the box all to hell. And I actually used this for my eye look for the Easter collab that I sadly lost. But here's that. And I do want to mess with it some more. Um, I did an eye look using the Crimson and Hibiscus and some other ones um, I did on Fast Forward. And then here is the Hank and Henry that I actually got in the same Ipsy box. Um, only this one was just like part of that month's. You guys see something down there? Well, goodness, this just does not want to come out. I'm sorry if I'm making you guys dizzy. I should have taken things out of boxes. But here is the Hank and Henry. Here are the colors on the back. I don't know that I've... Nope, I've not. So I will do an eye look with these. I've not... doesn't look like I've done one yet. All right, one moment and we'll be back for more. Okay. Woo! <laughs> here is the very first thing I've ever won. And I won this... Um, from Laura Jean Loves Beauty, um, this deck of Scarlet. Um, the person that had won it didn't claim it, so she did a like random pick a number and I was closest. And here is what this looks like. These are eye color or lip colors on the end, the smooch and swept away. And then there's the bronzer, the blush, and then the three eye shades. And it came with a lip liner and an eyeliner. And then, um, let's see, we'll do the next I won um, in a collab, um, a St. Patrick's Day collab. Um, Darissa Rain chose my comment as the winner. 
and I was sent from Karen and MUA this blush palette trio I've used this a lot and then I was also sent this B Bella Cosmetics Champagne Kisses number one and I have used um, just one set of those I'd like to do um, another look with those here soon I'm just going to set that to the side because we're almost done. And then my first friend mail, I received a bunch of stuff, but um, as far as the makeup items, well, first um, I was sent this NARS palette. I haven't really messed with it much, but there's that. And then I was sent this B Bella eye shadow palette. And I've used it once, and I need to use it some more. Those are the tones that I gravitate mostly to, the dark and cream, like browns and stuff. And then here is my infamous Morphe. Um, bronzing and height, or contour palette, I guess. Ooh. There's that. And let me see if I can do this one-handed. <laughs> Okay, the next I have the two items that I received from uh, Rhonda Said, which is a Smashbox, yeah, Smashbox uh, palette, and then this Makeup Revolution London um, Rachel Leary palette. Urgh. Why do they make these things so hard to get open? Okay, I have not made a look out of this, but I plan to. I don't want to blind you guys. I mean, that sun-kissed color is just screaming my name. Granted, I will not use that as blush. I will use that as eyeshadow. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to play with this one. And then the piece de resistance. Whoops. My birthday present. This has not, I mean, it's been opened. I have not touched the shadows and don't plan on touching. Oh, hold on, guys. You're going to get an extreme close-up here. One moment. I'm going to set you guys down for just a second. There is me, Jeffree Star. Blood sugar palette. So those are the palettes that I own. I'm going to clean up this mess and I will be back in a moment. 